Hi, I'm Karen Adams. I'm a longtime resident here in Aurora. I grew up here and I've had a long standing interest in photography throughout my career. And uh, I've taken many pictures and I was interested to get this assignment to come and join with the exhibit here at Hillary House. And uh, I have three artworks in this exhibit. Hope you enjoy. I found it interesting to come here because I'd never actually visited the Hillary House before and it was interesting to hear about the history and how this generation upon generation of, of medical doctors had lived in this house with their families and they grew up with the town around them. Firstly, I was drawn to the doctor's tools because they were displayed nicely on the table and it was interesting to see some of the tools that he actually used along with the glass cupping because I thought that was more modern. And then the way they were situated, you had them with the, the lace curtains in the background so you had this lovely soft feeling along with the, these hard metal tools. I decided to transform it into a sepia tone photograph to give it the feeling of the period so that you had these so wonderful soft tones, but it looked like it had been taken when the doctors were actually living in Hillary House. I was also drawn to the crutches because I myself have had so many injuries uh, and have learned to use crutches and how useful they are. And I was drawn to the texture of the woods and the different sizes of the crutches. When I first saw them, they were in the ante room, but I couldn't get a good enough angle. So I thought it would be an interesting way to juxtapose them with the door and actually have the wood textures of the different crutches and the door and the door would be where the patients would be coming in through so there was a connection there. I transformed it into a black and white photograph because I thought the black and white photograph brought out the textures in the wood of the crutches and of the door plus it also brought out the lace on the curtains beside the door. Um, my last photograph was from the outside of the wraparound veranda because these people that were coming to these doctors, they didn't come for a sniffle or the flu, they came for something very serious. So it was with trepidation that they approached the doorway. So as long as it was a welcoming uh, atmosphere, then they wouldn't feel as, um, as fearful when they approached the house. And you mustn't forget that this was also a house where a family lived with children. So it had to be a welcoming entrance. So through digital manipulation, I transformed the photo so you could see light in the shadows, but then also I thought it would make it a nice dreamier effect if I used a painterly um, plug-in that we used, uh, and it just sort of created a nice softer image and it took off the harshest details in the parent, and to give it that apparent feeling of welcoming and being soft and, and creating an atmosphere. I think that we had the facility of working with digital cameras in the current age. In previous ages, say maybe even 20, 30 years ago, when you were stuck with a film camera and not allowed to use any kind of flash attachments, and with low lighting as you have in this house to preserve the artifacts, uh, the digital process has allowed you to uh, shoot the, the artifacts without any sort of damage, and you could use your cell phone, you could use the uh, larger digital camera and still get a beautiful image. I think it's important that all these artists have come together in a celebration of Hillary House to celebrate this Inspirations from Space of Healing exhibit that we're all partaking in. And it's important that we uh, keep awareness of this historical building and the culture that Aurora brings to all, everyone who lives here, and that we can all celebrate together. Hi, I'd like to end by saying a big thank you to three institutions, Hillary House, which is part of the Aurora Historical Society, the Aurora Cultural Center, and of course, Soira, the Society of York Region Artists, for this wonderful opportunity to celebrate Hillary House and our art. Thank you.